The Carbotec 13 inch desktop thicknesser is a great bit of kit and I love using it. But I was finding that I was getting quite a bit of dust that wasn't being picked up in my two horsepower dust collector which is sitting right next door. So I started to have a look and on closer inspection of the plastic manifold which screws on the back, I found there were quite a number of gaps around this manifold. And so I set about trying to come up with a way of improving it. Here's the back of the dust collector with the manifold off and you can see the port where the dust comes out of. When you pull this apart, you'll see that that metal piece sits above the spiral heads and it has a plastic manifold inside which directs the air to the pickup in the bigger plastic manifold. And that's been sealed off along the edge with some foam uh, but at the ends of that foam and along the edges there is some leakage to there. So here I am taking the metal component apart to get inside. Once I was inside I was able to add some caulking to fill up the holes and to make sure the seal along the edge of the foam was uh, a, a good seal. I then reassembled the inner manifold and placed it back in above the cutter head and moved to the plastic manifold next. For sealant I just used some cheap expanding foam that I got from the big box hardware store. After cleaning the plastic with some isopropyl alcohol I then proceeded to stick the PU foam onto the plastic manifold uh, taking note of where the best seal would be up against the metal frame. With all the foam in place it was time to have a look at the mechanical construction. Here you can see the inner manifold sits a little bit below the cast iron and so this is not ideal. So by placing the smaller washer below the plastic with a larger washer above the plastic I get a much better mechanical attachment and I don't deform the plastic. I made those up first and then I slide the plastic manifold in under them. I did have a small washer in the middle to start with but I changed this later after the video for a bigger washer just to give it a little bit more uh, mechanical advantage and not deflect the plastic too much at one point. I could have made a bar to go across from one side to the other which may have worked better but this seems to be okay at this stage. Here I am testing the unit back installed and to do that uh, I'm just using a piece of paper towel. Of course the, the thickness has been turned off the whole time and it's not active. Uh, naturally um, and so we use a piece of paper towel and uh, just have a check to see that there's no drafts running anywhere that uh, there shouldn't be and we're ready to go with a, a real test with some wood in the machine. So there you have it a few passes light passes of black wood but uh, very little in the way of chips coming out of the machine and just about everything going into the dust extractor now. Thanks for watching and remember uh, thickness is a dangerous beast so if you're working on one unplugged at all times.